How to fix the issue of Windows has restarted your GPU drivers in the League of Legends. Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. In this video presentation, we'll be talking about fixing the issue that says Windows has restarted your GPU drivers in League of Legends. So Windows restart GPU driver due to various causes like outdated drivers, operating system, background apps, GPU damage, or overclocking. You have to find the solution for the GPU issues. Perform preparatory checks for the Windows GPU driver error. For that, you have to check the GPU fan airflow, then ensure the stable power source and disconnect the peripherals. Inspect the GPU for the damage and check the device storage. Also restart the PC for startup error check. If error persists, updating your operating system can resolve the bugs impacting your computer and leading to the GPU driver restarting. If you encounter problems with the Windows update, terminate the task for the unnecessary programs. Simply click on the start button and type in the task manager and then choose to launch. Select the CPU and the memory usage option in the task manager. Select the applications using lots of CPU resources and memory space on your PC. Windows rebooted GPU driver because of an issue, old operating system can lead to this problem. Fixing the GPU reboot can be bothersome due to various reasons. Effective solutions are available for this issue. Select the display driver you want to update from the drop-down and then click on it. Click on the update driver software option and then select search automatically for the drivers. Disable the Intel overclocking, start, go to control panel, hardware and sound and power options, change the advanced power settings, go to process power management and set both to 99%. Then apply OK and restart. Underclock the GPU to enhance the performance and troubleshoot effectively. Replace the GPU for the performance issues. Find the best graphic drivers for the gaming or USB-C central GPUs for the PCs. Fix the GPU problems like games stuttering on the Windows 11 and you can share the feedback in the comments. So this was all about it. If you found this video helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing for more helpful tips and tutorials. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.